Ganaret, a world with 1,000 facets, with kingdoms and peoples waging their wars as the gods distractedly look down at them and move their pawns. To tell the story of this divine cruelty, let us follow the exploits of this young, peaceful man who, before he married, wanted to experience an epic adventure. To the great displeasure of his lady, he decided to join the legions that were gathering in Aldrifa in order to sail to the north and crush the barbarian incursion. Despite a long goodbye and many tears, he knew he had made his choice. Destiny was waiting for him. He took his father's old sword in one hand, a large shield in the other, a light purse at his belt, and set off on his great adventure. He knew he had to travel by foot. Fast transportation means were too expensive. With inflation, what do you expect? Walking was not his thing, and with aching legs, our young hero approached a dodo dealer who was selling these exotic mounts at an unbeatable price. The old nag looked a little long in the tooth, but the merchant promised it would make it to the gates of Aldrifa. Traveling brings many hazards, and this journey would pit our hero against a formidable foe, a satyr. The creature rushed down to do battle. Our protagonist quickly dismounted and raised his shield. The enthusiastic Dodo rushed towards the satyr, probably expecting a handful of oats, but it got the angry creature's deadly hoof instead. With a colossal kick, the satyr put an end to the Dodo's squeals. Satisfied with his kill, he strolled back from whence he came. finally arrived in the streets of Aldrifa, he made his way directly to the town square. This was where the troops were meant to assemble. He hoped that the Duke's forces hadn't already left. But his hopes soon faded. It was too late. The legions were already sailing on their great quest. But our hero wouldn't surrender so easily. He decided he would follow the coastline and traverse the arid plains of the north in order to meet the troops. Despite the long distance, the hunger, the thirst, the exhausting heat, our young soldier never gave up. His destiny was to fight in defense of virtue and honor. Soon, the battle would be joined. The camp at last. Once again, our hero was out of step with the troops. But now, he knew they were nearby, and he would be among them to hear the first battle cry.
earth will be drenched in blood and tears. The gods will turn away for an instant, leaving the people of Ganaret to fight this merciless battle. Thus concludes the first chapter of a violent tale which has only just begun.